Coordinator for Data and Information at the Meteorology, Climatology and Geophysics Agency BMKG Class 1 Maritime Meteorology Station Sarang Tarjono said the crossing from Merak Port, Banten to Bakohini Port, Lampung in the northern part of the Sunda Strait is relatively safe. We guarantee that the movement of the Merak Bakohini crossing is relatively safe, said Tarjono in his statement in Sarang, Wednesday. The weather in the waters of the northern Sunda Strait on December 21, 2022 with wave heights ranging from 0. 50 centimeters to 1, 25 meters. The wave height in the northern part of the Sunda Strait is in the low category. Thus the flow of Christmas homecoming using the ferry crossing service for the Merak Bakahini port route, Lampung, is guaranteed to be safe. We believe waves up to 1, 25 meters high are quite normal for the Merak Bakahini crossing, Lampung, he said. Meanwhile, wave heights in the waters of the Sunda Strait south of Bantan and the Indian Ocean range from 2, 50 to 4, 0, 0 meters. Weather in the Sunda Strait waters the southern part of Bantan and the Indian Ocean are in the high category. Due to the influence of the tropical cyclone Darien in the southwest of the Sunda Strait. Fishermen and cruise ship operators as well as tourists are wary of waves with a height of 400 meters. Ships and victims to avoid sea accidents, he explained. Confirmed regarding extreme weather at Merak Port, the coordinator of data and information for the Sarang Maritime Station, Tarjono revealed, since two days ago the Banten Climatology Station had predicted extreme weather that might occur on 21 December 31, 2022. Then the central BMKG has also released a few days ago the weather conditions ahead of Christmas were rather extreme. So it is true that extreme weather has occurred as predicted and pre-released by BMKG, said Tarjono when contacted by Suara Kong, Thursday 22, 12, 2022 evening. On that occasion, Tarjono also mentioned the predicted wave height for the Bakahini Marak crossing of around 1.2515 meters. So medium category, what made the waves at Merak Harbor strong, the wind was observed to be quite strong, the wind speed itself could reach 20-25 knots, he said. Tarjono also ensured that safety always provided information related to the weather forecast for the Bakahini Merak cruise. For the final decision, shipping for the port manager, in this case for the Merak Bakahini crossing. It will be DPTD Land Transportation Management Center, he said. Regarding the decision whether the ship at Merak port waits or continues the voyage, Tarjono said it was under the authority of the port manager. So BMKG, providing information that has already had an early warning like that, and indeed the final decision rests with the port management. Can the ships that are docked, can be departed or wait for conditions to be conducive, said Tarjono. Merak, Siligan City, Bantan, as for the results of monitoring this afternoon until tonight. The waves at Merak port are quite high. He also said that loading and unloading at Merak Harbor is still running even though it was hampered in the afternoon and started normally at night. This afternoon there was a delay in loading and unloading I just received the video, it's starting to go a bit sloping though yes, the gin is still strong, concluded Tarjono.